Hey guys, Spray SprayandPray here, and welcome back to Victoria 2. We're playing as Russia still, and I just reduced our infamy down to zero because we made it a year without actually going, uh, getting into any containment wars or anything against us. Uh, unfortunately, I was too stupid to remember to actually click the button and do, or actually go ahead and do it. Uh, so, like, within six days after the war, you know, after we should have done it, um, and me forgetting, France and the United States both declared separate containment wars against us, so now we have to go kind of kick their butt a little bit, uh, which shouldn't be too hard. So let's go do that. I think the next tech we need to get is the, uh, yeah, we definitely need to get this gas attack stuff, so we're just going to do that ASAP, now that we've got our, all of our tech stuff done. Uh, what province is that? Okay, that's actually that one. So let's get about 300,000 dudes in here. Yay, we got 105 prestige. We got an alliance offer from India. I'm not going to call any allies into this war because technically since it's a containment war, we shouldn't have them. So I will I will still abide by that part of the rule. But, you know, I'm not going to stop accepting alliances because we kind of need those. All right, let's take 300,000 dudes over to Russia and see what happens. Or not Russia, France. Well, we could probably find some place where there's no troops to land. Hello! You know what? I'm not going to do that, actually. I'm going to go back here. I'm going to see if I can find a way to actually walk into France without having to do this, because if we just drop troops off, that's not going to work. We're going to get wrecked. So maybe, like, Spain or somebody is willing to give us uh, military access? And we can just hide in the Pyrenees. Actually, that might be really awesome. Yes, Spain. Thank you. Okay. Alright, let's take our troops back then. Alright, if we can hide down here and fight them in the mountains, then we're actually going to do really well. It's actually pretty convenient, too, that they've taken over more of the mountains down here. For us. There's literally three provinces you have to stand in, and, uh, yeah, those are all mountains. Good. Alright, let's get back up here and get another 300,000 primed and ready to go. The French will... Did we attack them in there? Oh, yeah, we did. Whoops. Let me pull out of there as soon as I can. Yeah. Just, that's what we don't want. Alright, we got mass politics. Now let's get ourselves some gas attacks. Alright, our navy unfortunately ended up having to fight these guys. Sad face. Alright, for whatever reason they left, so... What the fuck? They, they teleport back there? Are they going to get there before us? June 13th? We're going to get there on... June 12th. Okay, so we actually won that. So let's split that in half and send half in there. And then we're going to want to get them into Griona as well. Alright, and now, yeah, we definitely did get the defense in the mountains. Alright, and let's hurry up and get some more dudes to back them up down there. Might want to pull out of this one. Alright, they definitely need more dudes in that fight. Let's send 150 to each one. Um, a dummy. I should have taken that alliance. Sorry, Italy. Certainly. Good. Alright, we can get them into there as well. Alright. Uh, we might as well get the whole army over there, since it doesn't look like we're doing anything else. 
All right, we can now do another socialist shift. So yeah, we're getting pretty pretty socialist over here. So hopefully, we'll get some actual socialists to spawn. We have been unable to do that as of yet. My navy just taking its damn time. Yes, they like to do that for whatever reason. Oh, I'm a dummy. Uh, Italian liberation, sure. Is two Sicilies allied with anybody scary? No, sure. I'll help. I don't. I, I don't mind. Two Sicilies shouldn't exist anyways anymore, really. They're a secondary power, and Italy's our friend now, so they're only gonna get more powerful. <sighs> All right, was there? Okay, we got India here too. Good, good, good. All right, and we got another three hundred thousand uh, Russians coming to help this fight here. Right, let's go pick up the last of the troops. We might as well just have everybody over here for some fun times. How's all of the military? Oh, looks like we need a lot more small arms. Eh, well, we're getting there. Let's make sure we're upgrading all these factories when, whenever possible, too, because, you know, there's a lot of unemployed craftsmen. I'm, I'm sure those factories used to be gigantic, and that's probably why. Okay. Alright, so they're pretty much stuck over here. So I'm just going to put in more dudes. That army actually died. So I'm going to pull back and see if it takes attrition still. Yes, it is. So we need to split those up further. It's probably just because it's mountains. But yeah, they're just going to keep on sending themselves in here and breaking themselves upon us. So it's not that terrifying. Let me see what the rest of their country looks like. Cool, we invented stock exchange. They still have quite a bit of troops over here, so I'm going to just drop the rest of these guys over here in Spain. Actually, the best place I think might be here, but will that give them a minus two? I don't know. I think so. They might actually ruin the, my whole skill over there. All right. Okay, cool. All right. We got most of these dudes over here now. I think this is actually our whole army, so that's nice to have. These guys are losing. That's also nice. Looks like they're all actually moving in on that battle, which is great for us. Let's do the same thing. We'll send some guys over there just to clean them out in the back there. So that side should be ours now. And pull back some of these dudes so they don't take attrition. Pull up the big army. Same thing here, we're gonna split that up. But yeah, the, the French are done over here now. I don't know what that army is doing. The fuck army. <laughs> What are you doing? Now, that was probably a gigantic stack too, and it had this dude dumb rebel suppress thing on, so you know it just likes to run all over the place crazily. I don't think I ever turned off St. Petersburg as a rally point, so time to do that. Let's do that here too. Let's just grab all of our boats and put them together.
I don't know what we're going to do about uh, USA. I think they'll eventually offer us white peace. I really would rather not invade them. It's not really a convenient place to do it like there is with France. I think like after 10 years or something it just automatically pieces out, so we might get lucky there. Let's get Dreadnoughts percolating. Some more dudes into that fight. We'll send everybody in. Why not? We'll just keep various troops in the reserve. Just to make sure they can't run away. Coast of Holland. Hey. Hey, mine. Quit that. I don't know, France. I don't know if we can take just white peace from you, buddy. Can you make you liberate, like, something funny? I don't know if we want to do all that. I mean, you know what, France? I guess I'll take your white piece. How about that? <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> I just feel like I have to do something to them. I could cut them down to size, I think. Or just humiliate them. Who knows? I think they're better off as an ally, honestly, right now. There's nothing really we want from them, so we'll just let them say they're sorry. Okay. So we'll take these guys home. And we can spread out in our newly won lands. And also figure out maybe what the heck we're going to do about the United States. We could, of course, invade them from Russia. Russian Alaska, if we wanted to. Like from Kamchatka and stuff. Alright, that should be fine. Long live the Russian Empire. How are our cores doing? Do we got any NATO cores over here? I was cockened. They're still uncivilized. Let's go ahead and establish a protectorate of them. We'll see how quickly we get caught. But we need some some infamy to uh, to be getting rid of. Or else it's not fair. Let them hold their rally. No problem. I see no problems with rallies. Spain wants an alliance. Sure. Our Doom fleet is looking pretty good. Pretty good. We've got our Casas Belly speed. Split that in half. I think I would like to take those two units over. They seem really balanced. We use them to fight Cockend. And uh, while we figure out what the heck we're going to do about the United States, especially them sending dudes over here to in infiltrate us. Alright, I guess I am going to have to... I'm going to be forced into sending dudes over there. Alright, let us let me grab uh, let me grab the army. And then we'll send our navy over to the Pacific and start invading through there. This way we'll put, put down... Uh, be able to put down these advancing American scum. They think they own the entire world. Can police me, the great Russia. Right, yeah, we'll send our entire army to just be stationed over here in the Korea. Okay. 
Okay, yeah, they've also they're also occupying our China provinces, which is not good. All right, and up here too. So, yeah, we'll crush those armies, get ourselves some nice war score, I guess. You want me to come help them against Austria? I don't really want to fight Austria. I'm going to decline that. I'll let them do their thing, though. I'm sure they'll be fine. Yeah, I don't really know what to do about that, Italy. I'm sorry. Let's go ahead and get some more health care to increase our birth rates. Okay, and uh, did we get to Cockend yet? No, not yet. And declare the second that those units get there. This will be the last of the uh, of these historical Soviet socialist republics. Well, you know, for for the big uh, Kazakhstan one, pretty much. Oh, nice! We just got gas, so we are going to actually make short work of any of the Americans that are on our soil. So I can't wait to actually engage them. Let me grab like a 72 stack. Send that up there. Battle of Tungshu. Okay, let's get our guys together. Cool, let me annex them. Great. I'm going to start decreasing relations with Punjab. We might be able to fill annex them if we're lucky. I think we can. I think it's late enough in the game that it'll let us. Let's get this 70 stack over there. They keep on crushing my poor little stacks here. Don't know why it keeps letting them get built. But whatever. Let me grab my big navy. Okay, we're going to take the navy over here and park it in Korea, because that's where all of our dudes are. Let's attack this guy and see what happens. So yeah, we have gas attack and they do not. So it should be pretty devastating. It's making up for the entire dig in bonus up here. So it's, yeah, they're they're just getting shredded. We're going to the H province somewhere. Alright, we're up here in Siberia where there's no no help. It's pretty bad attrition. But it's okay. There's a twenty sec going to that province, really? Doesn't seem very conducive to living. Alright, we got our steel steamers. Let's go ahead and grab infiltration so we can get tanks going. We want to get army NCO training right after that for the morale boost. Let's get these boats out in the ocean here. Let's just land a stack on their ass. Get some oil there. We keep on decreasing relations. Alright, let's see. I'm pretty sure you can justify uh, just annexation here. Straight up. 